Good morning, welcome back to my channel. I'm Gabby, if you didn't know, now you know. And today we are prepping and packing and getting everything together for Camp Geneva, which is Top Gun's cheer camp that we go to every year. It is finally that weekend. So, just got up, took a while for a walk, got out of bed, did all that stuff. First up on the list is we're going to Party City. It works out that this time of the year is also Halloween. And the theme for Camp Geneva this year is once upon a time, like fairy tales. So, double O, tried to pick everything and everything was taken. So we are Aladdin this weekend. And I got all the girls these cute little like skirt things to wear one day. So I'm gonna go to Party City, get matching scrunchies to match all the skirts. And then I have some other things that we need to get. Like someone's gonna be a tiger. So I need to get like tiger ears and tails and the monkey ear and tails and whatever else we find. So let's go to Party City. All right, we're in business already. We got the genie lamp, we got the tiger stuff. I can't find the monkey ears and tail. Wait, monkey tail. I found it. Right I can't there, right? reach that. No, what about this? The monkey set, no? Oh. I mean, yeah, that works too. That was so much easier than I thought it was going to be. We went down the exact aisle we needed to when I was just trying to get to the back. Because now I need to find scrunchies of every color skirt. So far, I don't see a single scrunchie. Okay, I see that. You see blue? So we ran into a problem. They have every single color, like I got almost all of them, but yellow and orange, which I don't know how, especially yellow. They just don't have them, so. So we were finally home. We made a few stops after Party City and I figured I'll just show you everything I get at home instead of trying to frantically vlog in the store because Party City did not go as well as I wanted it to. So you guys pretty much saw everything. We got, oh, did it come apart? Wait. The monkey set, because I think Adam's gonna be a boo from Aladdin, obviously all of this is because of Aladdin, so We got the little monkey set so he can do that and then I think Mark is what I was told is going to be the tiger then we got the genie lamp and then obviously all the scrunchies that we could find that they had to match and then I Went to CVS because I figured one I needed like travel body wash and stuff like that So I got makeup wipes. I got travel body wash some travel toothpaste and a toothbrush because I have one of these and honestly I feel like it's old and I probably need a new one. So got one of those and then they had these, which obviously not ideal. It's like a lot and I don't need a lot, but they at least have orange and yellow that I think are gonna match. So I figured I could always use more just plain black and white scrunchies myself. This is also very crooked. I'm sorry for the angle right now. But anyway, we got two of these. At least we have some. I think other people have some orange scrunchies that they're gonna bring as well because we technically need four. These are only two, but it's better than nothing. This drives me nuts. CBS, I spent maybe like $20. Why? Why does the receipt have to be this long? So annoying. Next up was Publix. So the way Camp Geneva works is technically there is a cafeteria with like cafeteria food. I was never, even growing up in like elementary school, middle school, I never ate cafeteria food. It always catched me out. So. I'm going to bring an electric tea kettle, which I need to make sure I have somewhere. Yes, right there. So I have that, which is just gonna like boil and heat up water, so. I'm going to live off of Easy Mac and cup of noodles all weekend. So then I also got some of these little bite chocolate chip muffins for breakfast because I'm not waiting in the line at cafeteria at 8 a.m. to get some breakfast before everything starts, so I'll wake up at the last minute, grab these, and go. Then I got a nice big bag of gummy bears, which I will probably eat every single one of these by the time the weekend's over, which is not good, but there's so much downtime to just sit and snack in the cabin, and I'm going to do exactly that. So then I also got these cheese at Snap jalapeno chips. Never tried this flavor. They look very good. Got some vitamin waters. I only got two, and then I also got a case of water and a little like crystal light thing for flavor. That way I'm covered with majority of drinks for the weekend. Everything else that we got is more so house stuff. We needed like toilet paper, paper towels, tissues. What else did we get? We got bacon, we got yogurt, butter, creamer, body wash, soap, oatmeal. Nothing fun. So I'm not going to give you a haul of all that stuff, but this is my snacks for the weekend at least. I'm obviously going to vlog Geneva so you guys will see the cabin situation and like we're literally in the middle of nowhere. We're in the middle of the wilderness. I don't even know what part of Florida. It's like a four hour drive away. I, I don't know where it is or how they discovered this and whatnot, but um, yeah, so hopefully I can survive off of this food for the weekend and be okay. 
I need a shower because look at my appearance right now. It's rough. So we're gonna handle that. As you can tell, I showered and then our food got here. So we sat and watched an episode of How to Give Away with Murder while we had lunch. And I think that episode gave me a panic attack. I'm like freaking out. My heart is beating so fast and he like had to leave to go to work as soon as it was done. So we didn't even get to like discuss it and like contemplate what the heck just happened. So I am like on edge right now. But anyway, we're gonna keep going with the day. So I wanna get one last nice good hair wash day in before I'm in a cabin all weekend. Gonna try to not wash my hair all weekend. So I did that using my favorite Function of Beauty products because you guys know I've been on the hair journey. Now here's the thing. Once I realized that my hair was like very damaged from bleaching it, from heat, and just like I panicked and just thought that I needed to try a whole bunch of different new things and I went from like high end to like a whole bunch of different products and a lot of them worked to do certain things but what I love about Function of Beauty is it's completely customized to you and I feel like I truly made these formulas to really give me everything I need in my hair. So I always get the purple shampoo to help to not keep my hair so brassy, especially because I'm trying not to dye it right now. So this at least makes it a little bit more of an ashy tone blonde. But I feel like now my hair is at the stage where it's just ready to have something that's gonna help maintain it and just help bring it back to life just a little bit more. And I thought about it and I was like, the one thing that I used to use when my hair was the absolute healthiest and like the only thing I used was Function of Beauty. So we're going back to our roots. As you can tell by the very almost completely empty bottle, I love these products. Not only do I love them because you can completely customize the formula, like I said, you can customize the fragrance and you can literally customize the bottle. It says your name. It's hard to see on these ones. So I have my brand new ones that I'm definitely gonna need very soon. This is the perfect color. This is literally the conditioner of my dreams. For the first time in a long time, my hair really does feel like it's back to its normal state, which makes me so happy because my hair is one of my favorite things about me. So it's super important to obviously take care of it and really give it products that help to maintain it and make it the healthiest it could possibly be. And I know I can trust Function Beauty because it's dermatologist tested, so I know that it won't irritate my scalp and there's absolutely no parabens, no sulfates, and it's 100% vegan and cruelty free. So get started with Function Beauty today by going over to their website, taking a very short quiz, just explaining your hair type, your hair goals, other things that would affect your hair, and they'll create the perfect formula for you. Now it's easier than ever to try Function Beauty's top rated signature hair duo, and you can do that with a discount code. So make sure to click the link down below and you can get your first custom formula for only $30, including free shipping. And let's continue on getting ready for camp. I think the plan now, I have some clothes in the dryer right now, so I'm gonna try to let those dry before I have to pack. And what I think is going to help keep me calm, <laughs> ground me a little bit, and just help make this process go as easy as possible is I'm going to make a packing list and I made already a very generic one just for the team in general. So we got the main stuff here that just like everyone's gonna need to bring. So I'm gonna go through in the extra space right here and just kind of put all the very specific things to me, the extra things that I need, like my camera, my camera battery, anything else that I wanna bring that I didn't wanna include the packing list. I think I'm, I'm done with the packing list as much as I can think of off the top of my head. Now it's time to find the things that only come out once a year, like the tea kettle, some sheets, I need a different pillow, and honestly, I don't ever know where anything is, so it's a fun game of like, where's everything I need to take for Geneva? So our first stop of looking is gonna be under the couch, because this thing is like storage. I forgot about half this stuff under here. Okay, wow. We got some good stuff under here, what the heck? Aha, fitted sheet, I found it. We're gonna do a little, a team gift haul because we got these last night at practice so i have to pack them anyway so they need to come with me so we're gonna take them out this one is obviously not part of the team gift but this is our staff shirts that we have to bring for geneva this is 305 it's the area code of miami and then the back just says staff once family always family miami so technically so tgsc goes so like technically i have a team that goes but I'm gonna be an athlete all weekend, so I'm really, unfortunately, not gonna get to be with them hardly at all. Look how cute these sports bras are, so. It's a fun, I don't own any sort of practice clothes this color, so I'm very excited. I feel like this is a shade of like orangey pink coral, I don't know what you call it, that makes you look really tan, and honestly, I have not seen the sun in a little bit, so. Hopefully this does me some justice this weekend. The back is super cute, little crisscrossy. Peachy Pia, Sophia's brand, so. She's the best, always making our practice clothes. Then we just got plain black of her shorts that are like Lululemon kind of like duplicates so they fit the same way, they're super comfy. So those are just plain black to match the sports bra. Look how cute this is. We got a bucket hat. 
so that's coming with me it is so cute super cute literally perfect color you guys know me i'm obsessed with this obviously um double o tank top again in the same like rhinestones but this one is just more blue to go with that practice outfit it's so cute so tgsc has practice tonight and i think they're all getting team gifts too so i might get a few more so we'll have maybe another team gift haul when i get home from the gym tonight i just laid all these out to get like a part of the thumbnail and he is just posing for his picture huh he's so cute i'm gonna miss him so much here we go We've made a lot of progress. So I think the suitcase is pretty much done. We have makeup, I have an extension cord. This is all practice clothes and like cheer clothes for the weekend. This is pajamas, this is sports bra, shorts, stuff like that. This is actual clothes for the weekend. This is all my shower stuff. And then in the zipper pocket, I have my sheets, my towels, sweatpants, and a hoodie. I think suitcase is good to go. I'm gonna bring one pair of sneakers and just wear those all weekend because I'm not gonna bring anything nice. We're gonna be in the woods it will most likely rain as it does every single year and then it's like muddy and gross so i'm not gonna bring any nice sneakers we're gonna bring one pair just my nike 270s i kind of pretty much have every outfit around that if i need to wear them then the next thing up is just packing my cheer bag for some reason people always request a what's in my cheer bag so we're gonna do a very brief one because it's nothing special so i definitely could not make a whole video about that but let's see what's in my cheer bag the back pocket this is our coach binder it has like everything we need to know all rules legalities um timelines important dates pretty much just everything we need to be a top gun coach so that stays in the back of my bag but i'm actually going to empty that out because i do not need that for geneva so that's coming out i have another schedule of important dates that just got wrapped up in there I have some athlete absentee forms that got shoved in there. Some pens, and that's pretty much it. So that's the back pocket. The main compartment, I have my Vero's that are very broken right now, and I can't wait to get new ones. Like, they literally are falling apart. I have a water bottle that I'm not going to need, but that's always my practice water bottle. I have streamers from... When I won Worlds, these are what they like gave out at awards, so I kept those for fun, you know? I guess I also have a gray Calvin sports bra that I didn't know was in here. Super fun. This is as much of a surprise to you as it is to me because I don't even know what's in here. I have my like necessities from Worlds still in here. Obviously I didn't open it yet, so we're gonna leave that in there just in case I need them. I have tampons. Um, I'm not gonna be on my period of Geneva, thank God. So I don't need these, but you never know. So we're gonna keep them in there just in case. I'm gonna put my shoes back in there. And then this top compartment up here, I have like deodorant, hand sanitizer. That's pretty much it in there. This is just full of masks, which I'm just gonna leave in here because I might possibly need them at some point this weekend. This is like scrunchies and random stuff, so. I'm gonna go through it because I know I don't need all of these and I'm gonna add the ones I do need for this weekend. And honestly, I think that's it. So hope you enjoyed this wonderful segment of what's in my cheer bag because I didn't even know. And I think that's all we can do for right now. A lot of the other stuff I'm gonna need to use before I pack it up, like my toothbrush, my straightener, hairbrush, stuff like that. So we're gonna be at a standstill for now. I just got ready to go to the gym. I have a pretty easy day today. I just have a private for 30 minutes and then I have TGSC practice. So might get some phone clips. They did a gender bender practice on their Tuesday practice, which I'll put the picture right here. And it was really funny. I don't know what their theme is tonight. It's gonna be a surprise. So if there's anything worth vlogging, maybe I'll vlog them opening their team gifts and then I'll show you guys when I get home. But either way, I'll see you whenever that is. Oh, baby. We're home! TGC practice was really good, and then I got a clip of them opening their team gifts, which is probably the clip that you just watched. So I'll give you a little haul of their team gifts. So their fairy tale for the weekend is Lilo and Stitch. Now, is that a fairy tale? Probably not, but we went through so many options with them and almost everything was taken. 
or they like all couldn't agree on one specific one. So Lilo and Stitch was majority rules and they approved it. So we were like, we're gonna count it as a fairy tale. So we got this little gift bag with the name tag being like a little stitch, says Coach Gabby, so cute. The girls got like, pretty much the girl stuff is all Lilo and then all the boys got like stitch stuff. So super fun. Um, starting off with a pair of these fun little stitch socks. Super cute. This tank top I love because it's just like a plain white tank top so I can wear it to the gym all the time, but it's so cute and different. So it says, Ohana means family, and then once family, always a family on the back. This is actually super cute. I feel like I'm gonna wear this all the time. It's just nice, simple, white and black. This would be really cute to tie-dye, and I think that would be such a fun team bonding. So I think that I'm gonna suggest that because that this would be so cute tie-dye. Other than that, we got a little Lilo scrunchie, which is so cute. And the girls all have like matching red sports bras to wear with that outfit. It's gonna be super cute. We got some fun accessories. They have grass skirts. We got a lay. Ooh, wait, this is like, this is like a fancy lay. That looks legit. And some candy. So that is their team gifts. I will probably pack the tank top. That way if I am with them at all, I can rep them. So I'm gonna end this video here. The next video that you're gonna see is gonna hopefully be the Geneva vlog considering I leave tomorrow. So get excited for that. It feels like real cheerleading is back again and I'm very excited. So that'll be the next video. I wanna thank Function of Beauty again for working with me on this video. Look at how nice my hair is. Okay, granted I was just in the gym, but like even so, it's still so smooth. Oh, it's nice and like ashy without me having to go to the salon and fry my hair and it just feels so nice. So luckily this will last me through the camp weekend so I don't have to worry about washing my hair again. So make sure to check them out. Everything is linked down below and I think that's it. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Cloud is sniffing me so we're just gonna bring him in and let him end the video with us. So give it a big like, comment down below, subscribe to your post notifications on all that and i'll see you in the next video